Yo guys, it is Brune Dude 63 coming at you with another video. Hope you guys like it. Please subscribe and enjoy. This is GM mode number 5, so hope you guys uh, stay in tune with this and our last video, GM mode number 4. It was the trade deadline. Uh, we got, uh, cl I think, uh, a first round pick. I'm not technically Columbus. sure. Uh, Columbus, there we go. Thanks, Bracton, for reminding me of that one. Uh, so we're going to simulate uh, the rest of the season and see how we are uh, in our playoffs and if we're able to clinch a spot. So hope you guys like it. Please subscribe, and here is Bracton. All right, we are in playoff position. This is very good for us and for the Oilers franchise. We play Columbus two times this month who maybe have just traded us, Connor McDavid. Uh, um, other free agency news, we got Joel Ward and Jesper Fast. We couldn't trade Jesper Fast to other teams. We were trying to get picks for the draft so we could get more of future prospects, and I guess it didn't work. But we got one. That's the most important thing, and we have a 40-win season going on. We are on a two-game winning streak currently. I don't know about the past month or so, but... Did we put those guys in the roster? I think the assistant coach did. Awesome. That I, I have a good assistant coach. All right, so we're 42-24-1. We're currently the best team in the Western Conference and the third best team in the league under Boston and Tampa Bay. For all you Lightning and Bruins fans, that's decent news for you knowing that... It, is just a video game, but Bruins fans, that's nice to hear after the season you guys had. So I'm just I'm okay. no, I'm sorry if I offended anybody just there, but it's true. You can agree with me. And here comes the scout. I love uh, my scout. Hmm. Where do you where do you want to send him to this time? Send him across the world. Yeah, send him to Russia. We need a Russian on the team. That's true. All right. How about forwards? Right. Yeah, forwards cuz we need forwards. We don't need defense yet. So 6 weeks confirm. All right, so we will continue our simulation. It's almost April, which means playoff time for any of you students at school. Love the playoffs gets you through the last couple months of the year. We are on a one game losing streak, but we beat Columbus both times. Awesome. Columbus may have just traded us Connor McDavid, as I said. I hope they did, because they just dropped two straight. I didn't. Did you get a chance to see their record? No. Or because hopefully that still sucks, so we can be in position. All right, we're three game winning streak. Oh great, the guy who we just acquired for some playoff clutch. April 10th, right before the playoffs. That's alright. As long as he gets there in time, I really don't care. As long as he's fine and ready to go. For our opening round, we it looks like we're going to make it. Um, ho hopefully we get a 50. But this was the Bruins record, 46-27. and 27, And then did not make the playoffs. Like, that, like I said earlier, there was no guarantees. Oh no, we're on a two game losing streak. Hopefully we don't get to thirty losses before we get to fifty wins. We need to get to fifty wins. Then that would be automatic, I would think. See if we can get this. Shootout loss. But that's fine, at least we got a point. Alright, here comes April. Roberto Luongo comes back. I said he was hurt in free agency. That's why we couldn't trade Ben Scrivens to I don't remember. I don't remember who we were trying to trade Ben Scrivens to, but... One. Okay, here we go. Let's just sim the rest of this. Hopefully, the draft lottery is going to be huge. That If Columbus gets the first pick that they traded to us, Connor McDavid is ours. And maybe we don't have to do anything at the draft. Alright, win. win. 48. 48. Come on, if we just win two more of these games, we'll be totally fine, and we'll be set. Hopefully, yes, alright. Joe Ward is back. Okay, good. Right before the playoffs. Nice. Hopefully, I don't think we have any injuries. Hopefully 
correct me if I'm wrong, but I, I think we don't have any injuries. Here we go. 50? Oh, overtime. That, that didn't count against our record. Hopefully, we can win against Vancouver and complete the 50-win season. That'd be so great. No, of course not. Okay, so before we start the playoffs, if we got in, which I, yes, we did. We finished top of the, I forgot, I think the Central Division, I'm pretty sure. All right, so let's check this out. Good. I don't think we won the President's Trophy, but we did win the Pacific Division. I was wrong, not the Central. All right, let's see. Entire League. Fifth. Fifth. All right. But we're... Look who uh, came in last. Oh, yes. Come on. All right. So, draft lottery night. Ready? Top 20. Calgary. St. Louis. New Jersey. Washington. Dallas. Okay, good. I'm glad we didn't make that trade. Vancouver. Philadelphia. Arizona. Carolina. Dang it. Oh, it was Winnipeg. The one team we didn't make the trade to. But... But, who always wins the draft lottery? Second. The second. Buffalo was supposed to win it lit this year, but Edmonton came up from behind and won. So, good. I like it. I like it. We could have... We'll, we'll work out a trade with Winnipeg later. But for now, we are going to the playoffs. Let's see who we will be playing. In the Western Conference... Our first round matchup is the Colorado Avalanche. We will be playing the Colorado Avalanche. All right. All right. So, let's get this. Here we go. The regular season is over. Okay. So, congratulations. We have made the playoffs, and we have clinched home field advantage or home ice advantage. I play basketball, so. All right. Here we go. Home ice advantage. See, there it is. Yeah. Here we go. Simulate game number one of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Hopefully, we got this win. I can't tell. Let's go to the calendar. Game one. Win. 6 nothing. 6 nothing. win. Shutout. Game one. All right. Here. Yeah. Oh, wait. Was this the start of the playoffs? Yes. Oh. Okay, so game two we won. All right. So we are one and one. Oops, I did not mean to hit play. We can just hit back, hopefully. Exit. Yes. Okay. All right. We are one and one. This is a critical game three. We need to win right here. Can we take it? And we do. 3-1 in Colorado. That's a big win for us. Even though on the score sheet it's only by two. That's a big win for the fans. Now, we can put a stranglehold on this series and go back to Edmonton looking to win. If we can win it here. No, we cannot. But Victor Hedman has injured. Oh, no. That is not good. Critical game five. Winner takes a stranglehold on the series. Hopefully this game, these series does not go game seven. Do we take the win? No, we got shut out. This is it right here. Our guys need to prevail right here. If we lose, and Victor Hedman's back. All right, we got to stay positive. Hopefully we can force a game seven and head back to... Yes. Oh, okay, great. And Cody Gollumbuff, who I just got to seal a trade... Is hurt. I don't care. This is it. Right here. You can expect a lot of screaming or a lot of pain. The Edmonton Oilers. Here we go. Can we take the win? We lost and we are eliminated from the playoffs in the first round after the incredible season. That's it. It's all done. Heartbreaking. Just devastating. Eighth seed just upset us and oh, that just stings you know work so hard trying to get these guys set traded all our picks for the future is now 
But I guess not. So I guess we need to look forward to the draft on the 23rd. I know people are disappointed. And of course, here comes the scout in our time of sorrow. Sorrow, that's right. Misery. Send you back to Russia. <laughs> Dang it. Yeah. Sure. That sucks. That could have gone longer. Oh. Great. That's just great. Oh. All right, draft. That's our number one priority right now. Can we squeeze this into this episode, the draft? I think so. Or Yeah. All right. Maybe we could get the trading in. Hopefully Colorado wins the cup. Because if they just got eliminated for no reason and knocked us out, I hate that. That that just at least we forced them to seven. Hey, look on the bright side. At least we made the playoffs. It, it, it's better than getting the number one overall pick, but ne I guess not in this year due to Connor McDavid. All right, month of June. We are only twenty two days away from the Connor McDavid draft. And this could be huge for us or any team. Oh, good. <laughs> uh, at least somebody. Oh, that's nice. I, I, too bad that couldn't have been real life. Dang it. Uh, good. Congratulations to the Rangers. And we will say that once we go up to the podium to announce that we have selected Connor McDavid with the first overall pick. Oh, my God. This is huge. Right. Did Columbus win the draft lottery? I don't care. Just stay in Russia. <laughs> uh, this is the biggest week. This is the biggest couple yeah, weeks. We send him back to, um, oh, because we can't. S Whatever. All right. Now, welcome to the draft. We are very excited. Very excited. And then free agency. That starts very soon. Here we go. Draft day from sunny Florida. All right. We need... Hopefully we got it. Do we get it? No. The p Arizona. We need to trade for the pick. Need to trade for the pick. Need to trade. Hurry up. Um, We tried to get this. We need to get get Eberly and... Oh, no. Not Ryan O'Reilly. We have we have to hurry up and get this before they get Connor McDavid, Eberly gone to. Okay, we got to get Eberly out, and we need to get Darnell Nurse out. I'm going all out. I promise you guys. When we started this, I would fulfill my my promise and get the top dog, Connor McDavid, and this is it, Shane Doan, and. This is it right here. I need to pull this off. You guys. Oh my God. We. Oh yeah, because Arizona. We need to get one more guy. We hurry up. They are. They have two fifty-seven left to make their pick. And of course, it's gonna be Connor McDavid. Who else would it be? All right, sixty-one. Here we go. Oh, there's a fifty-nine. Arizona would still have more than 50 players. How would you... Okay, fine. Um, uh, we're not going to get this deal done, guys. Uh, Murphy. Ryan McGinnis. All right. All right. Please. Wait. The season's over. So we get a fresh new draft picks. So I could trade my first... No, I wouldn't trade your first. For tw in 2021. Oh, they wouldn't let me do that. All right, get lucky. All right, maybe not Eberly. Can't be Eberly. Who is it then? If it's not Eberly, it's got to be Taylor Hall. I promised I would bring. Okay, how about Hedman? Yeah. Hedman, all he did was get hurt on us in our time of need. So. Close. All right. Pull the trigger. All right, not Nurse. How about. And Everly. Alright. Oh my god, if they don't accept this. Oh my. 
It's Connor McDavid, though. What do you expect? Uh, but how do we know if he's going to be good? We don't. I know. <laughs> We're taking a big risk. And Richie. Oh, I want to do that. And no, Richie's terrible. Come on. I know. All right. This is it right here. 257 left. Oh, please, please, please. I go for uh... 57. Here we go. Oh my god, it's not going to let us. Oh. Okay, how about Hedman and Ryan O'Reilly getting younger? Alright. Oh. Alright. Okay. Ah! Uh. Totally unwilling. I don't care. We're trying. Tori Krug. Uh -huh. Or Niskanen. You choose. Niskanen. Niskanen. Oh, God. I'm selling the farm. Who has the second pick? I think Edmonton. We no, do. We are Edmonton. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Maybe there's a miracle that they won't pick Connor McDavid. Oh, it's Winnipeg. We have the third. All right. Let's try and get Winnipeg. You think we can get Winnipeg? Yeah. Alright. Watch them pick Jack. We need to get Jack Eichel. How about Eberly? Just send Eberly. Let's just keep doing the same deal. Eberly and, and Hedman. Right. See who take him. We need to take somebody that they don't want. Two guys they don't want. <sighs> Come on, no, no one wants to get rid of anybody here. It's a draft. All right, and this is gonna be huge. Buffalo? No, no, man, we're not going after. Uh, all right. Oh my God. We gotta take another guy. Sixty. Come on. Winnipeg, Winnipeg would be over the salary cap. All right. Now what we need to do is take some salary off their hands. How about... Blake Miller. Who? No, Wheeler. He's too high or a good player. Uh, Let's do... Salary. Here we go. Two million. No. Three million. Matthew Perot. Here we go. Edmonton would have more than 50 players. Delete. There we go. There we go. Delete. No. Okay. Um, I'm just trying to get this exactly right so we don't overpay. Scott Konchmichuk. All right. Try this. Would this work? Why? He's two of the best players in the NHL. All right. We can't do that. You want to just do that? Straight up. I, w I wish we could just do that straight up, but no. And Scott Kosmachuk. Alright. Let's just try and edit that out, though. Oh. Well, let's see what they said. Hit propose again. You already. Alright. Uh. Hmm. Ryan O'Reilly? Nurse. Nurse. Alright, you know what? We're fine with third. I think. You want to? Yeah. Oh. Oh, we mean we gotta trade the pick. You wanna try and trade it? Wait. Uh, hashtag St. Louis retire. <laughs> what? Zidane Chara decides to retire from the game? Sim. Well, wait a minute. What's Arizona doing? They're well, we gotta... Alright. Well, I guess we're watching and we're waiting here for Arizona's pick. It should be Connor McDavid, but if it isn't, we will make a trade with Winnipeg. We will get that done. <sighs> Sim. 
Connor McDavid, Erie Otters to the Arizona Coyotes. Ah, uh, what should we do? I will trade for him. It's not like I will not trade. Yeah. I will try. You know what? Let's move up. Let's trade him our pick and somebody else. Want to try that? Yeah. Move up for two? Okay. Let's, let's do We're that. Two. Yeah, move up. We can get rid of pick three. Um, we could, all right. I'd rather give um. I'd rather give um, the Coyotes our first. Well, they're gone. They've picked. Oh yeah, you want to try that? Like yeah. for McDavid? Okay. All right. Then we're out of the draft. Yeah. Unless we make a trade. All right, Arizona newly acquired Connor McDavid. What is he, a center? Yeah. Oh, it won't let me do it until the end of the draft. Oh, wow. All right. I want to move up with Winnipeg. I want to get number two. So let's do this. Let's get their draft pick for our draft pick and... No, not to move up one spot. No. How about Yakupov? Try that. Oh, I've got to get one player. How about Andrew Stafford? All right, let's see if this will work. Oh. All right, no. Um... Yeah, let's just give him a bunch of picks. Even though we don't have great picks, we can try. Six. Five. We're trying to move up in the draft, guys. So we can try and get Jack Eichel. That's our man right now. All right, try this. All right, you know what? Last try. If I don't get this, I'm fine with Hannafin. All right, no, I'm. F I'll take Hannafin. We are going to give them Yakupov, but not for Stafford. We are going to give them Yakupov for T. Randall. They're crazy. Yes, we moved up. Well, the Edmonton Oilers are now on the clock. Who's on the floor right now? All right. The Edmonton Oilers would like to select. Oh, what? Where's it? Where's Eichel? Oh my God. Where's Eichel? Where's Eichel? Hit all leagues. Hit LT. He's U.S. Oh, no. He better be here. No! Where the heck is Eichel? Oh, no, no, no. Are you kidding me? Wait a minute. We just... We the world. Defense? Do they have Hannafin? What? This is stupid. Are you kidding? You want to trade it? Well, we got nothing to do now, then. I don't want anybody. There's nobody I would want. Let's trade it. That makes no sense. Offer trade. Oh, crap. I gotta call a timeout. Timeout. Yes. Okay, good. Alright, I have got to hurry up. I have six minutes to pull off a trade. Um, well, now that there's nobody we want, that was dumb trying to get it. 
So it was McDavid or bust, pretty much. Um, okay, think. Poor McDavid. <laughs> oh, yeah, you can't do that at the end of the draft. Oh. Uh, how about to Boston? Who do we want? Who do we need? <gasps> I know what we do. Who? Tyler Sagan. Got it. Tyler Sagan. We try to get Tyler Sagan with Taylor Hall. Okay. Sagan. Oh, God. All right. So we got that first, and we'll give Eberly. Right. So Eberly? Oh, God. This is it. This is huge. <laughs> yes! Yes! All right. So Sagan joins the Edmonton Oilers. See, that is better than wasting yes. a pick <laughs> on something. That second overall pick in Jordan Eberly. Good, luck. Good. Dallas is on the clock. You just want to do draft summary? I want to try and get a later draft pick and trade that too. For who? I don't know. We just put, we just got Tyler Sagan. Who do they pick? We just simmed all the way to our pick. No, I just simmed their pick because I wanted to know who they got. We know that McDavid is McDavid, so... Oh, we did sim all the way to our pick. Huh, <laughs> never mind. Yeah, let's try. I'm just going to sim the whole draft. Pfft. Dang it. Well, that's fine. Good job. It was a good draft, not. We, we got two guys who were going to end up not signing. Well, free agency is the next episode. This has already taken long enough. That was the entry draft. We just got Tyler Sagan. I'll turn it over to Ben. So, hope you guys like that. Uh, kind of stinks that we weren't able to go far in the playoffs, but we had a huge uh, addition to our team. Uh, j as Sadly, we weren't able to pick up Connor McDavid, but we were able to pick up Tyler Sagan, which is awesome. So, definitely stay tuned for a free agency. Uh, this is GM mode number five. So, definitely stay in tune for number six. See you guys.